Adam Frost. Um, it started with a uh, failed abusive relationship and uh, that got me into therapy. I thought that I didn't need a whole lot of instruction or help with the past sexual abuse and uh, fortunately my counselor was smart enough to recognize that indeed that was the root of where most of uh, my failed relationships and relationships that I wish were different uh, came from. I would be surprised to find anyone that's been through a weekend of recovery that wasn't terrified. I was out of my element for everything. I didn't know the area. I didn't know a single person um, that was there. I, I don't think I've ever been as scared of anything in my life. And I've been on a 200 foot precipice before. <laughs> Within 15 to 20 minutes of, of starting the weekend activities, I could tell that it was going to be a life-changing event. The biggest change that's happened for me is, is how I uh, participate in all of the relationships in my life, whether it's um, from my parents uh, to uh, my, my friends to romantic relationships to colleagues, uh, pretty much every facet of interaction has been affected uh, by going through this process. The feedback has been that um, I'm a lot more calm, I'm a lot less judgmental, a lot less black and white with my relationships, and uh, a lot more forgiving in the facets of, of relationships. It's been a really significant point of change for me. I am very passionate about cycling. I, I love being on a, a, a road bike and just feeling, feeling the breeze hit my face. I love the camaraderie of riding with other people, bike riding in other countries and, and getting to know people in small villages or you know, stopping by and, and, and just interacting with people who are living life and not, not being a tourist and actually being a participant. I love to ski in the winter time. It, it gets me through the, the shorter days and uh, I have a, a lot of friends I love to ski with. There's a lot of bonding that can happen on a chairlift. <laughs>